going on everyone RC84 here like always thanks for watching out here at one of my local crawling locations right by the house not too far from me and it's a nice little location very saluted nobody really comes through here but it's a nice open field and as you see there's a road that continues on uh, and it's a great place to take the crawlers to do some trail videos my tanks or any other my off-road vehicles I come out here and play with because it's just such a great area because there's like a little bit of everything uh, rocks clay mud dirt uh, you know everything that you would probably want to do and it's all right here so I decided to take the, the Hummer out for its first true adventure not in my backyard but a true adventure taking it out on the trails uh, hitting the rocks the clay the mud the sand all that good stuff and uh, it did pretty good I was actually very impressed with it but I want to show you Sorry about this wind, guys. I'm sorry. Uh, somehow this wind just kind of popped up all day. It's been nothing but very hot and very calm. And now when I get out here and start filming, it wants to blow all everywhere. <laughs> but I, uh, like I said, I took the Hummer out. I hit those water and mud spots, which I really don't like taking my RCs into the mud and water. I used to back in the day a lot. Uh, it's just the, the, the headache of cleaning it up after running it in the mud and water and you have to grease up everything and, and uh, look at everything. But I decided to go ahead and take it out because, well, you know, I have the water receiver in there. I have the uh, Tamiya seal bearing, so that kind of protects it. Plus, I also protected the gears with a waterproof type grease. Now, the only thing that's not waterproof was my ESC and the sound system, but uh, I didn't really flood the thing in the water. Uh, I just went through the mud. So let me show you what the vehicle looks like all mudded up. So let me show you. Here we go. Ba -ba -ba. And I'm all mudded up myself. Let me get out of the sun so you guys can see. Ah, uh, yes. The mud is on the Hummer. Look how mud, how muddy the tires are you see that it's crazy over here in the back mud body's full of mud take it off look at this this is where the 540 series motor was really kicking in and splatting that <laughs> that mud everywhere as you see and here is the chassis as you see my life the battery's covered in mud uh, motor the wires everything it's covered in mud yeah, <laughs> look at this crazy mud everywhere. Crazy. Now it did end up getting stuck one time and when I went to go pull it out, I actually caught hold of that little metal bar that holds suspension to the chassis while I went and pulled it. And uh, when it did, uh, you know, the suspension dropped, but nothing broke. I don't, you know, don't see anything broke. <laughs> but just nasty it's gonna take me a while to clean this up and get it looking 
you know, good again. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, there's the Hummer body sitting there in the grass, just chilling. But yeah, so, yeah. So, so that's it, my friends. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Uh, please like, share, comment. If you got any questions about anything or something you want to see here on the channel, comment down below. Let me know, guys. So, uh, with that being said, I'm going to get out of this way and go home, grab a cold one, and sit back and relax. Thanks for watching, y'all.